Hi. Today uh, I'd like to show you my settings uh, I have uh, so far for my pits and for my receiver. And um, the first thing I have to say is that these uh, pit settings won't be the best for sure. And what you also have to know that if these pits work very nice for me, that doesn't mean that they will also work very nice for every other uh, drone pilot. So it's always an individual thing to set up the right pits and yeah. Uh, but I will show you what I did and perhaps you can try this out, perhaps you like it, perhaps not or perhaps it's a base you can work on and uh, okay. We will start. What I show you first is uh, I loaded Profile 2 because Profile 2 is uh, standard settings. We will talk about the receiver settings and the pit settings. And uh, receiver settings is uh, default. Um, I changed uh, uh, rate, RC rate and RC expo. You have RC rate of 0.9. Uh, at default and RC Expo, uh, which means it's, it reacts softer around center stick uh, position, and this is 0 0.65 as um, default set. And when I change to profile 1, then you can see uh, my settings I did. Uh, they are for aerobatics, and um, what I did is uh, no throttle expo, all to zero, RC rate to 1.4, which makes your uh, quad flip much faster without uh, changing the pits. So you have much faster uh, roll and, uh, uh, and pitch um, axle and yeah. That's what this changed. And the Expo, RC Expo, I took away completely to 0, 0.0 because I like the copter to uh, react very direct also around center stick and that's how it really works pretty nice for me. And then let's go to the pits. Um, the only thing I changed is roll, pitch and yaw, all the other stuff we don't really need. First I will also load uh, profile 2 so you can see what the standard is. We have roll with uh, proportional 4, pitch with proportional 4 and yaw with uh, 8.5, integral with uh, 0 0.03, 0 0.03 and 0 0.045 and derivative with 23, 23 and 0. And now I will change to my profile, uh, which shows you um, proportional for roll and pitch is same, is default. Uh, that's because I changed the RC rate to 1.4, which makes the uh, copter much uh, faster flipping and rolling. And then integral is just a little bit up to 3.3 to 3.5, derivative is still uh, default, then yaw is the one I changed the most, it's proportional up to 12, yaw is very uh, soft default and like this you have it a little bit more uh, direct feeling, it also stops uh, short turn a little bit uh, faster than with the uh, basic setup, with the default setup integral. I also put it a little bit up to 0 0.050 and derivative up to 10. Um, these are just my first tries to make uh, this cup to work better. In my opinion it is a little bit better, but I'm sure I will come up with uh, other settings uh, in a few weeks uh, and we'll show you what I changed again to get it uh, still better. Then perhaps roll rate, pitch rate and yaw rate too. Uh, we have roll rate at 0 0.55, pitch rate at 0 0.55 and yaw rate at 1.0.
that's all I did so far. Um, if you like, try it and fly your copter. It will fly for sure. But you have to be also uh, thinking about it is uh, the weight of your copter. Uh, mine is, with this setup, I think around 780 grams up to 800 grams. And I fly it with 3S 2.2 uh, batteries. They are around 190 to 200 grams. So it, this all uh, depends how uh, your pits uh, will work on your copter. So if you fly 3S uh, 2200 batteries, if you are almost in the same weight, this should work uh, pretty fine. And yeah, that's it. I hope you liked the video. Uh, try it out. Have happy flying with your quad. Have a good time. Bye bye.